Hey, everybody. Two boys, one, one brain, brain cell. cell. My name's Chuck Beeson. Joel Norton. And today, we're checking out another country tune. I'm introducing Joel to some country music. This one's Too Much Fun by Daryl Singletary. Don't look so excited. I can't have too much fun. <laughs> this song's about literally the opposite, but <laughs> we'll work on it. <laughs> oh, is it an actual fun country song? Yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, okay. Finally, you get off the tear in my beer type shit. <laughs> There's a tear <laughs> in my beer. No, it's not been so bad. No, I've hit you with the upbeat stuff. I know. I was just fucking with you. Stereotypically, that's what a lot of people feel like about country music, older country music. And I'm just here to break the stigma. Oh, okay. All right. Well, let's jump on in. Let's see it. Blue lights flashing in my rear view. The sheriff said, boy, I should have known it was you. You got 14. In the back of this truck I warned you twice And now I'm riding you up I said, officer What have I done? He smiled and said Boy, you're having too much fun Too much fun What's that mean? It's like too much money There's no such thing It's like a girl too pretty But too much class Being too lucky A car too fast No matter what they say I've done Never had too much fun. There was a fight Friday night at the Stumble Inn. Me and old Harley just had to join in. Next thing you know, we were both seeing stars. It threw us out, closed down the bar. I said the long branch is open, the night's still young, and we ain't never had too much fun. There, there's some nice typical w. stuff in there for you too. Yeah, but I I feel like I kind of like that typical stuff, like where there's like, uh, you got 14 people in the back of this truck. Uh-huh. That's some small town shit. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Can't ever say you haven't been a part of something like that. So, no, I I, I mean, can. I was one of the 14 in the back of the truck. That's what I'm saying. Oh, okay. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> yeah. We never got pulled over because you know. And I think the most we ever did was eight in the back of the truck. Yeah, it definitely wasn't 14. That's a lot That's of people in the back of the truck. That's a lot of fucking people. Were they, like, laying on each other at that yeah, point? Like, yeah. shit. Or it could have been an eight-foot bed. Yeah. Which, hey, still, that's impressive. Hay wagon. Oh, yeah. Oh, shit, I have been in one of those. Mm-hmm. Yep. <sighs> You're not a small town if you haven't been in one of those. Or at least yeah. around one that was happening. Yeah, come on. Campground stuff, all, too. Almost all my childhood. We were like, hey, we're going to go grandpa and grandma's, hop in the truck, and just throw, jump in the back. Yep, and they 100%. Drive, they drive down the thing. Nobody's blinked, tripped nope. past cops, waved, didn't matter. Yep. Yeah. Sometimes you're too, you're getting a little closer to the city, so they're like, lay down when you we pass the people. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> they don't call them bitch. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Fucking dad slide the glass door in the back. <laughs> get down, get down. Get the fuck down. <laughs> Goddamn kids dancing around back there. <laughs> what? Quit moving. You're shaking the whole truck. <laughs> oh, dude, you, that, that's that's accurate. The sliding door, the yeah. sliding glass door. You you weren't lying there. Damn. Do you remember the remember the trucks with the vents on the passenger side down by the floor? This is random, but the sliding back glass that reminded me of that. Vents. They were like a square, and you just slid it open, and then air would come rushing in from the front of the vehicle. I don't remember that, but I do remember having the holes in the floorboard there. So the air just came in anyway. Yeah, you maybe just had a broken lid on yours. I mean, it's possible, there, but yeah, I don't know. There was it was like a square vent thing, and you just slide it. It was like towards underneath the glove box. No, mine was in the floorboard. It was just a rusted out hole. Uh, okay, yeah, that, that no, that definitely. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't have that. It's called old trucks. <laughs> yeah, you had the roll up windows. The old oh floor. yeah, we didn't have the power windows. You know. We didn't have, like, automatic transmission, nothing. It was straight manual, and I'm sitting in the middle seat when I'm not in the back where my dad's literally reaching over my leg to shift gears. Yep. Like, this is weird. I don't like it. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah, we definitely did that stuff a lot, especially in the summertime. We were out there bailing hay or uh-huh. all and all that good stuff. 
Nice breeze after you're out there sweating your ass off. Oh, yeah. It felt good for you, and you know your parents liked it because they didn't have your sweat in the car. I didn't really thought of it that way. <laughs> they knew what they were doing. Sneaky bastards. <laughs> <laughs> Fair enough. Let's finish this one up, bud. Yeah. Too much fun. What's that mean? It's like too much money. There's no such thing. It's like a girl too pretty with too much class. Being too lucky. A car too fast. No matter what they say I've done. Well, I ain't never had too much fun. A tornado, wind me up, turn me loose, and let me go. Too much fun, what's that mean? It's like too much money, There's no such thing as like a girl too pretty, but too much class, being too lucky, a car too no matter what they say I've done, well, I ain't never had too much fun. No matter what they say I've done, well, I ain't never had too much fun. Give me the range and let me run, cause I ain't never had too much fun. Yeah. Very nice. Not bad. This yeah. 90s, too? Uh, Should I look? It's, it's got to be around then. I'll take a candor here. 95. Okay. All right. <laughs> I think everything I gave you was 95. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah, no, I, I enjoyed that. Mm -hmm. I... I got to, mm, is this my favorite of the three you picked or no? No. I think number two was probably my favorite. Yeah. I figured this one would be up there for you. This is probably my second favorite. Just because the upbeat, upbeat nature of it and the nostalgia that can be there. And the fact that, I mean, realistically, he's just talking about, hey, too much fun. It's not real. You can't have too much fun. You could just have a lot of it. <laughs> the... Rain sounds in your first pick is what I like those rain sounds. I know you do. I'm a sucker for rain sounds. No, it's still solid though, for sure. Mm -hmm. I just love the song. I was impressed with her, never the harmonica. Uh huh. I was impressive too. Nice little guitar solo in there as well. Uh huh. Hit you with some of that, uh, the more rocky vibes from the older country music. Yeah. Really hit you with. This isn't what you picture when you think typical 90s country. But it is what I picture, 100%. I'll I mean, it's I very did. radio country. Is it radio country? Oh, yeah. Okay. Well, it was. You know, back in the 90s. Back in the day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're but I feel like it's more upbeat than a lot of the older country. Okay. That's what I like yeah, about Yeah, I get 100%. Song, it, yeah. The last song from all that. Especially from what I've heard. Oh, yeah. Um, Where does your rating go for this? My rating on this one is an 8.1, and it's already in a playlist. I absolutely love this song. Okay. I'm going to go with a 6.7 playlist mm -hmm. again. Yeah. It's going to take me a minute to keep. Oh, yeah. Get used to the style. When you when you jump into something you've hated all your life. <laughs> yeah. And you're like, hey, let's try being open-minded. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> cause especially Screaming in metal. Yeah, no, no, absolutely, yeah, absolutely, yeah. <laughs> I it's, feel it's, it. <laughs> yes, yes, exactly, exactly like that. Um, and this whole little reaction thing we've done here in the last year and a half, no, year, excuse me. Yeah, just um, over. Just a little over a year. It, uh, it's definitely been fun just to be keep an open mind to try to new oh, stuff, yeah. listen to new stuff. So keeping the spirit of that, yeah. And I'm seeing, just, did, like, just seeing a couple different things that make you cringe that you didn't realize how much you would cringe when you heard it. Yeah. Like even when you're trying to keep an open mind about everything and diving into the punk scene has been really nice too. It's been different. Yeah. Just because you, I never realized how much I agree with a lot of the punk lyrics and stuff, lyrics and everything. Like a lot of the anti, you know, corporation, corporation and all that. And just, 
all that stuff with that. And I'm just like, I have agreed with this for a long time, and I just didn't didn't know it. Yeah. Right. Which, fantastic. That's a great example, yeah. Yeah. Because we, yeah. And I would have never even thought about getting into punk music without this journey. Tony Hawk 2 skate, Skater. Uh, <laughs> I showed you one song off it, and then yep. took off from there. And All our requests have been punk. And here we are. <laughs> Yep. And, and then symphonic metal at that. Oh, that's another good one. I never would have you, thought that I, oh my goodness, I found a genre that I absolutely adore in that one. Yeah, and not only do you were you hooked like immediately, which is like, what? Because it's, it's like a lot of instrumentals. Uh-huh. A lot. And long intros. And long outros. And, and, and I don't know what they're your, saying most of the time. And all your OCDs. Oh, yeah. And you somehow love it. And then you demand, Visions of Lannis is coming to Detroit. Let's go. We're yeah, going. We're going. We're 100%. Going. And I'm like, uh, oh. Okie dokie. <laughs> All right. I thought I was going to talk you into this a lot harder, but uh, it's sweet. No, no, not even a little bit. No, it's been a fun, uh, fun, fun little ride. Just trying yes. new stuff out and try to keep an open mind. Absolutely. An- Anti gatekeeping over here, guys. Having fun. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. So, yeah, but, this didn't make a play. So, yeah. Sweet. That all you got? That's all I got, bud. All righty, y'all. We are two boys. We have one brain cell. I'm Chuck Beeson. That's Joel Norden over here. Oh, yeah. And we ain't never had too much fun. Peace out. Peace out, guys.